Everybody and their dog has to come. Steve, where's your dog? Well, welcome back, everybody, to 7 Days to Die on Alpha 20. I'm an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we are going to do our first nighttime quest uh, as soon as nighttime hits, which is going to be very quickly here. Um, so I'm just cooking up some more food here in the stove. Uh, let's put that away in there. And yeah, we're pretty good on food. So yeah, by the time we get there, it should be nighttime. So let's head on out here. So I got uh, all my ammo, I got my medical stuff. Yeah, we should be good to go. Okay, so this is a restore power. I have done this, I think, once on the multiplayer server a while back. So this will be the first time I've attempted it solo uh, in a single player game. But I think the basic idea is you just get into the POI, you find the generator, and you turn it back on. And I think that's really all there is to it. I don't know that there's a whole lot more to it than that. Except for the fact that, of course, you have to do it at nighttime. So let's head on over and see what kind of trouble we can get ourselves into. All right, here we are. Not sure if I recognize this place or not. Just make sure nothing's tailing me here. Okay. There goes the power. So we got to get to the Jenny, which is apparently in the barn. And we apparently have to do that by crawling up the lattice there. I'm guessing, since that's where the lights are. Oh, look at you. Look at you, man. You dead. Oh, Larry the Lumberjack. Get the hell out of here, man. Come on back up, Larry. Oh, shit. <laughs> Two Larrys. All right, boys, come on. Off with his head. And he did. Okay. Now who's coming? I don't know where that other Zikaru is. See what's in the cupboard up here. All right, since Zeke's can come up that lattice there, we're gonna we're gonna block that off. Got a wolf down there now too. Wonderful. All right, let's check the bookcase. That's all we get. All right. Little hallway area over there. Up into the attic. That's always a safe thing to do. In a zombie infested apocalypse. Go up into the attic. What could possibly go wrong up in the attic? I have a feeling this is not going to go well. Let's get ready. Uh... Yep. Okay. It didn't go well. For them. Went reasonably well for me. What's in here? Ooh, nice. Oh, by the way, those yellow steel boots that we got in the last episode or the episode before are actually not better than my... The iron boots that I had, so I ended up keeping the iron boots, which kind of sucks. Okay, these are the same level. However, these are just a touch better. So let's get the thingamadoodle off of that. There we go. All right, where's this wolf at? It's hard to say sometimes in this game with the with the sound to know exactly where stuff's coming from. All right, let's go this way. Oh, well, there he is. Oh, 
We want to soften him up a bit. Can't get a really good shot off on him. Here, let's uh. Okay, he's dead. I suppose I could have left him alive to fight some of the zombos, but he's too he's too dangerous to to do that. I'm willing to bet too. A lot of these zombies we hear uh, were called in from um. whatchamacallit feral sense and not part of the actual zombies of the house maybe maybe not I don't know shit how the hell are you missing that unbelievable take those now let's go ahead and peel up here we don't want to take any chances big mama where the hell did you come from oh you're all trying to get through there all right it's a lot of Zeke's they're even trying to get through there. Alright. Let them come. Let them come, I say. Now let's repair that. We'll check the shoes in the meantime, because that's what you do, you know, when you have a horde bearing down on you, breaking through the walls. You check shoes on the floor. Okay. It's a lot of Zeke's, man. Holy crap. Shit. Are you dead? You are now. All right. That's how you do it, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you do it. Oh man, if only those were the the motorcycle handlebars. Uh, I'm just going to sell those because we already have a mini bike. All right, let's check these. Guess we're supposed to go that way. Let's go back out here and take a look around real quick, though. Did we... Yeah, we must have come that way. I'm pretty sure we did. Um, but apparently we're not supposed to go down at this point, so... That's fine. We'll follow the quest the way we're supposed to. We just came through there, right? Oh, we didn't check this. Okay. So go around here. We were in that room there. Ammo pile. Wait, are we supposed to go this way, though? Nope. I think that was just leading us to the ammo pile. Okay, let's go back this way. Uh, there isn't really a way to go down there, either. All right, maybe we are supposed to go down here. There's our wolf friend. There's a safe. Okay, we'll sell all that stuff. Let's just stick that there momentarily. And open this safe up. Full out of mod. Alright, cool. Cool, cool. Not really anything out here of interest. Uh, we might as well get the brass. Let's do it. Alright, so this is all opened up back here now, but we are encumbered. Nothing 
Nothing there. Couple of bookshelves. Uh. Wait a minute. Do we know how to make the gyro now? We do. Look at that, man. Hmm. We're gonna have to come up with 187 steel, but that's pretty cool. All right. That'll probably be coming up in our on our near future. Very cool. All right, we got the kitchen here. Where's our bike at? It's uh that way. I need to go offload. Oh wow, look at that. Another purple wrench. Very cool. So this leads downstairs. Okay, before we go downstairs. I want to uh, offload here, so let's just cut out, cut through the house here. Where is my axe at? There it is. Okay, let's head on down. Oh, he hit me through the stairs. That's hacks, man. That's total hacks. You're hitting me through the stairs, too. Bullshit. Oh, it's a crawler? Yeah, I don't know who it is. Oh, it's an Edgar being a dumbass. That's what it is. I was going to say, man, where the hell did that come from? I got tagged, but I didn't. I couldn't tell where it was. Total hacks. Nothing there. Nothing there. Those are not lootable. Get some cloth out of that thing. We got a door that's locked. Oh shit. Uh, I see three dots. Take care of them. Nope, don't care about the stones. Yeah, we'll take the hops. I guess that's what those are. This is quite a bit of wood. Let's grab it. Because why not? What is in here? It just goes back in that room. I don't think that's anything there. Is this the way I'm supposed to? Oh, this must be the way I'm supposed to go. All right, so I am I gathered that this is locked then. Yeah, it is, okay. See, I thought that's the way we we're supposed to go. There's the power right there. Okay, so do I just do that? Okay. You guys coming through this door? Or where are you going to come? I want to make sure I don't hit that fuel barrel there. Will not be good. Hmm. All right, let's put that back up there. It's just one of those deals where I have to... 
I have to do it takes multiple attempts and each time it quits I get another rush seems like it it's all right though I mean this isn't a bad place to, to make a stand here um, can we put a thing here yeah we can put that there <laughs> okay let's try it again that sucker smoking we did it hot damn we did it all right cool so is there supposed to be like a a switch or something i don't know i just go out this way into the barn yeah that'll open that door okay let's not open it yet Just looking around here. Nothing inside of there. There's a doghouse up here. Any doggies? Nothing in those things. Oh, there's the stuff up there. I'm gonna say, I thought I saw. That loots. I did. I just gotta go up higher to get to him. Do a little bit of light parkour here. All right. Let's see what we get. There we go. Look at that, you guys. Desert Vulture. We just learned the the Magnum uh, book. I think on the last episode where we get do more damage with Magnum. So that's awesome. Okay, that's gonna replace our nine millimeter. Uh, for our pistol. Let's see what's inside of these guys. Learn how to harvest brass from doors. Okay, that's a good one. And, uh, I guess we already know the baked potato recipe. I'm going to break that to make sure there's nothing down there. Car parts box. Okay, we'll take that. Pop the pills. Not bad. And uh, the fat loots. Let's see what's in here. Is there anything over there that we missed? Yeah, there's an... Uh, looks like there's an ammo pile over there. Okay, we'll have to go back over and get that too. Wow, and a magnum too. That's freaking awesome. Okay, we got a, a map. Let's read that closer to home though. So this does 95.1 damage. This one does nine less damage, but it's got three in the magazine more. It's semi-auto, uh, and it's got a little more durability, too. All right, here. Let's, um, well, you know what, though? I don't have any magnum rounds on me right now, so we'll have to, we'll have to play with those uh, later. Okay, let's go back and grab this ammo pile. Sweet. All right, this turned out to be a pretty good, uh, pretty good run tonight, man. He did. Okay. Uh, well, it's three o'clock in the morning, so um, I will see you guys. Uh, what I'm probably gonna do is go back to the base. Uh, where was the doorway out? Here. Uh, I'm going to go back to the base and drop all our stuff off. And then by the time we get that done, uh, it should be around 6 a.m. for the trader to open. And then we'll do a turn in and then take the next quest. So I'll see you guys at the trader a little after 6 a.m. All right, guys, we are back at Trader Rex. Um, so I decided that we would go Dirty Harry style. So I got the Magnum revolver uh, with a... Uh, a muzzle brake mod and the 2x scope mod in blue dye. Doesn't it look awesome, man? Beautiful. Um, we don't have, we only have, I think, one point in handgun skill, but remember, we did find the book that gives us 10% uh, more damage with magnums, plus, this thing just flat out does 109.1 damage anyway. So, 
We should be able to pack a pretty decent punch with this. It's definitely not going to be a... Uh, oh, wow. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Shut up. Wrecked him. Be quiet. I'm trying to gloat over my... Well, not gloat. Joy. I'm trying to joy over my new tar. Um. Yeah, wow. Nice, nice one. Okay, we'll take that. I was... What was I saying? I can't remember. I was going to say something else. All right. Uh, let's take a look at your inventory. So we're going to sell some stuff to him. Um... I got that other compound bow, so it's a little better than this one. So we, we fix this one up. We're going to sell this to him. Uh, we're going to sell all of this. Get this sold to him. The silver gets, gives us 770. We don't give a shit about spear parts. And we're going to sell those to him. Also going to sell him both of these ratchets. And I think that's it. Okay, cool. All right, so, now that we're done doing business, how do these two compare? All right, so this one does about 12 more damage. Uh, has three more in the magazine, and it has a faster fire rate. A little bit less range, but that's okay for this. And durability is a little less, too, which, again, not significant. Okay, cool. That was a very nice reward. Very nice reward indeed. Okay, so cool. We got a tack rifle now, guys, or a tar rifle. Tactical assault rifle. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. 46 in the magazine, too. That's that's a lot of rounds. Holy crap, man. That's a lot of rounds. I love it. Okay, cool. All right, let's take the next job from him. Um, He's got a fetch and a fetch and a clear and another clear. These seem like they're getting a little further out, too. So let's do this fetch and clear here. Can't say I'm not uh, let's also get some stuff from here, too. Oh, has his inventory reset? I can't remember the last time we looked. Day 40. I'm pretty sure we've already looked at it, but let's look at it again just to be sure. Magnum Enforcer. Sprinting with a 44 gun. Yeah, I mean, what does the oh, so end Magnum thing give us? Open the doors. All shots with 44 ammo penetrate enemies. All right, that's not bad. Man, we have a lot, a long ways to go, though. So I don't think I'm going to spend money on that. Um, uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure we have looked at all this stuff already. Yeah, armor are the mods. What he's got for mods. Okay, we haven't checked. We haven't checked any of the other traders, though. Okay, so it looks like we have a video store. And a police station. I have not been in here. Is this a working vending machine? It is not. So, um, I, oh, what did I do with my, I must have left my other ratchet back at the base. Son of a bitch. I wanted to take this apart. All right, well, whatever. We, we're not really supposed to be double dip it anyways. Oh, shit. There is a kitty over there. The cat's not coming over here? Come on, dude. Get up. Will you die, please? All right. Uh, okay. Oh, that's right. This is a three-round burst weapon. I do have a fully automatic mod back at the base that we can put on it, though. Everybody and their dog has to come. Steve, where's your dog? Is that it? We done? Okay, I think we're done. Um, alright, so let's get these guys reloaded. And we will 
put a few things in here. Uh, you know what? I should have sold that to him, him actually. That's all right. Okay, let's do this. This is a fetch and a clear. Marlene. Off with your leg, Marlene. Oh, I guess your leg didn't go off. She's feral Marlene, too. Oh, Jiggly. Soldier boy. Did we get Jiggly? We did. We sure enough did get her. All right. So is this supposed to be, this is supposed to be like a blockbuster video store, isn't it? That's kind of funny. Uh, anything to loot over here? That door's locked. Oh, working vending machine. Hot damn. Um, all right, let's take that, 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 and those. Don't really care about the covert cat so much. What? Hey! Hacks. Total hacks. Hey! Oh shit, okay, we're infected and we got a sprained arm. That's just lovely. That is just lovely. Okay, let's take one of these. Might as well check the toilet. Got a kniffy in there. And, um, the infection might be a bit of a, a conundrum for us because I don't have anything, I don't think, in the bike to deal with that. Oh, I hear another mountain lion around here. Um, yeah, nothing in the bike to deal with that. Son of a bitch. Okay, well, I guess what we'll do is... That isn't even worth doing anything with. Uh, let's take this now. Let's just keep going. I mean, I've got stuff to deal with at the base, even if we don't make it back in time for, you know, the five minute. For honey, we've got the, the better stuff, so I'm really honestly not too worried about it. Let's just keep moving here. generator. Nah, I'm not going to do anything with that. I will take the radiator. Is that a thing? Nope. All right, now we're going over this side. Frickin' Edgar hiding behind the thing there. This was a, a police station, I think, wasn't it? Close that door. Would really like that uh, beanie mod, man. Yeah, that's not as good as what we got. Let's close that door. Coffee? And, oh, I don't want any of that stuff. I will take that. see a red dot. Two red dots. Hey, how'd you get through? Here, another body drop. All right, what do we got over here? <coughs> oh, Freaking nose, man. I'm so tired of this freaking cold. Pissing me off. Oh. Let's 
It's got some knockdown to it. Oh shit. Switch. Let's run back here. You are bleeding. Nah, we're not bleeding. We're good. We got this. I'm a little bit better with the shotgun. <laughs> you know, you don't have to aim and all that. Okay. So, a bunch of those yahoos came out of here. I don't care about that. Any safes in here? No apparent ones. Oh, did we check that water cooler? I don't believe we did. This door is unlocked. That uh, medicine cabinet isn't working. Is there a cop right there? There sure is. All right, let's um do that. I think we just managed to piss him off. What are you gonna do, homie? There's a safe and a thing to open a door somewhere. Probably a jail door in the other room. I'm guessing. Alright, let's do this first. Alright, nice. Steel club. Probably won't do anything with that, but we'll hang on to it for now. Oh yeah, this is what we need to do. Okay. Equipment rack with some orange military and... Can we not get to this? Uh, those are vitamins. These have heat, decent heat resist. I don't know, we'll have to compare them to uh, what else I have for that. I actually don't want that shit. Because uh, I am trying to slowly put together a desert suit, uh, or, you know, desert outfit. Because we are going to need to go find some oil shell. Wow, look at that. An M60 and a sniper rifle. They're not very high levels, but still, M60, guys. Whew. Wow. All right. Those are all the same rack, huh? Interesting, man. Okay, so that does 45.2 damage. This does 59.7. That's 46 in the magazine, 64 in the magazine. Effective range of 45. I mean, this this level 1 M60 is damn near as good as this one. I think we're going to switch. I think we're going to go with this for our oh shit weapon. We're only going to be able to put one mod on it, but that's okay. Um... That mod will be the uh, this guy, so we can put even more in it. All right, so it won't last very long durability-wise, but you know this is a special weapon, uh, specialized weapon, I should say. We're only going to use it during oh shit moments. Cool. All right, so we opened up the fat loot room there. Uh, we still need to get our supplies back too. I guess that's the reason we came this way. Um, and then, oh, okay, so it opened up this door, too. Why do I get the feeling, oh, yeah, look. Look up there. That door doesn't close now, either. All right, um. Let's put that there. How do we get their attention? Oh, nice. Acid. Acid in a desk. Interesting. That's not a place I would have thought to find acid. Or acid. 
Did you punch a hole through the... Oh, yeah, you did. Look at that. I got another one. I hear more footsteps out here. Here we go. It's a bow. Yo, bow. Oh, he tagged us. You son of a bitch. All right. So, um, yeah, this is, uh, I guess what we do here. You know, we could just aggro him and then come out here and take him on out here. Yeah, I think it might be easier. Well, on the other hand, though, we could shoot him through the bars if we do it there. Here. Oh, shit. Look at the lag. Look at the lag that that caused. <coughs> Alright. Looks like there's four or five of them. Let's start blasting away. Are we done? Okay. So we've cleared all the Zeeks. We still have to get our satchel, though. Wherever in the hell that thing is. Is there a crawler in here? Satchels back this. Oh, is it up there? Sure enough. All right, return to trader. Excellent. Okay, let's get rid of that shit and get rid of that shit. Um, I'll bet this sniper rifle. Where did it go? Oh, that does seventy point five damage. Seventy six point two. That's modded. That has a magazine size of 12. Yeah, it's uh, it's pretty much superior to the lever action in just about every way. So we're going to be switching to that too. Okay, let's see what we got in here. Some parts. Medium ammo pile. Eh, alright, I guess I'll take those. Some boots. Um, I'm going to take the die off of those. All right, nothing down there. Check the toity. And the fat loots. Okay. Eh, it's okay. Okay, stuff. All right, let's go do our turning. All right, Rectum, what you got for us? Snappy. I got congratulations. Another tack rifle. Lord Look at that, man. Uh, okay, well, let's take that, if for no other reason, because of the price. And I want to sell some stuff to him. All of that we're going to sell to him. This is going to be worth more as parts. We'll sell this stuff here. Uh, and this... Okay. Um, I'm just trying to think if I want to sell this or not. No, oh, I'm not gonna sell it yet. Me, huh? Well, maybe you should try Shamway. <laughs> okay, so this guy is yeah, a little bit better than the, the yellow one. We get seven fifty six for that one, and over a thousand for that one. Um, let's sell him the yellow one. Well, actually, hold on a sec. Uh, we're going to sell him this. I don't think I want to steal a club, so let's see how many. We got eight repair kits, so let's repair that. This we're going to scrap, because right now it's 44. But the four parts together are going to be 176. All right. Let's sell the military. No. Hmm. I think I'd rather scrap those. These we're going to sell. These we're going to sell. And yeah, I think I'm going to I'm going to hang on to, well, is there any reason to though? I mean, this this gun is pretty much just better all the way around with the exception of a little more range and durability. Yeah, I don't think so. 
Um, and I don't have enough extra gun mods that I want to put one on to increase the value before I sell it at this point. Okay, so we're going to sell you this, this, all of those, this, that, and this AK. All right, that gets us 12,000 coin right there. This we're going to scrap for the for the military fiber parts. <laughs> Shit, man, I treat you that good, and you don't even fucking tip me. All right, so you got a fetch quest there. Hey, jerk, you need some and work. Old man, sir. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to do this fetch quest for him in the next episode, because we're out of time in this episode. And then uh, probably do another night quest uh, in the next episode, too. So, all right, guys, that is it for this episode. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share the video. And uh, we'll catch you in the next one. I'm just going to probably pick up right where we left off here and keep on going so I can get the next day one done. And then I get the night quest from him before he uh, closes for the night. Okay, so see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.